welcome 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 back welcome back so guys this is gonna be my final thoughts on keto for now maybe if i come here another time it will be different but these are just my final thoughts for now okay so the resort is located in anova and it is a all-inclusive adult only resort um you have a nude and a prude side you can choose to go nude over on the prude side and you can't go prude on the nude side beach or so because it's like they have a sign that says no clothing past this sign or beyond this point and all that good stuff um it has i think a total of seven to eight pools yeah a total of seven to eight po oh hold on coming coming sorry oh really yeah thank you <laughs> okay 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 guys so someone just came to my room saying i got a surprise what the fuck What the fuck? <laughs> what is this for? What is this for? Y'all. What the fuck is this? What? Should I open this on camera? Okay, let me. Very good girl, Carlita. It's so good to be back. What the fuck? Oh, there's a letter. The girl from the piano bar last night. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. Should I cut this? <laughs> Should I cut it out? I fucking cut it out. What? Oh my god. How? <laughs> Y'all, yeah, nah, hold on. Is it, is this? How to fucking act, y'all? Are you looking at this? Oh my, um, oh my god, this smells. Yo, I gotta find her at the piano bar. Oh, the brunette. Um, yeah, I. I'm sorry. I've never had a girl buy me anything. Damn, very good girl. Mm, very good. I'm a bad girl. Who told her I was a good girl? Anyway, yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. I have my wet, um, my wet bikini over there because um, it's wet. So I put it to the window, but I close the window because I'm on the nude side, and I don't want y'all to see naked people walking around in the background. So, you yeah. know, right um they have a breakfast a breakfast um self-serve you have to wear a mask while self-serve while serving yourselves okay it's a rule you have to be wearing a mask while you're serving yourself so while you're taking the supper to in the plate you need to be wearing a mask okay um of which that is understandable because you know if you're talking spit me fine at your mouth and whatever and i tend to talk a lot when i'm picking up food i'm like oh yeah i should get that maybe not maybe this maybe that so i kind of understand where they're coming from i'm gonna try to include some clips though in this video i'm gonna try to include some clips on here for you guys um there's a boat ride included in your stay not the cabana but there's a boat ride included in your stay so when you come here you can ask about ask for kirk 
ask for Kirk and ask about their boat rides, okay? Ask him about the boat rides. She says, like I said to you, you can just ask for these guys because they have been very good to me. So I want to give, you know, let you guys experience the same thing that I've experienced. So if you want, then you can ask for these people. And also Super Mario, Mario, Mario. I see you, Mario. And also, I want to say a big thank you to the resort general manager. It was nice meeting you and all. He was, guys, he, his customer service level is up here. He's a man to his word. Um, you know, I just really appreciate when people can be people. And they're not because of their status. They act as though, you know, they're more than. He is a very warm gentle soul so you guys can definitely look forward to amazing customer service so there are a few things that i want to take off on my box so as for the food that's a 10 out of 10 for me the food is always a 10 out of 10 and the activities are a 10 out of 10 because they have theme nights every single night there's a theme night. Let me grab the paper, the letter that I got so you guys can understand a little bit more what they do on each night because I want this to be as detailed as possible. As you guys must have seen, the last clip that I put up before this, I tried to include everything that I did not get the last trip. And I said, there might still be a few places that I did not get, but there's always time for another time to get the rest of the details. So this is for persons thinking about coming here and not knowing what to expect not knowing if it's worth the price not knowing this not knowing that so i'm just here to help you guys out this is my third trip here not my last based on my sponsors they loved my hedo videos like the first and second videos they loved those so they decided to push a little further with the sponsorship Okay, so let me grab the PayPal so you guys have an idea of what they do every single night. Hey guys, I had to relocate because my battery died, so I apologize for that. Okay, so like I was stating, they have the nights every single night. So such days around the world, so you know, if you're Asian, Jamaican, whatever, you dress according. Sunday is Wild Western. Get your boots on and your best hat time to party cowboy style. Mondays is Jamaican night. Dress it up in amazing Jamaican colors, black, green, and gold, and party to the pulsating beats of the island. Um, body art glow rave is on Tuesday. Glow jewels, neon, rhinestones, vetsa, and body paint. And on Wednesday, it's neo Victorian fetish fantasy. So, whatever your fantasy, you play it out, okay? Thursday is Casino Royale. Think James Bond Casino Night or a fun night in Las Vegas. So that's the theme on Thursdays. Friday, rock, rocking rock stars. Dress code, dress as a rock star or your favorite rock idol. Okay, um, right, so that's it for Friday. All right, so restaurants and opening times, you have all that. You have daily tennis clinics. Um, gymnasium and fitness program water sports center bars and opening times and whatever okay so you have also different places that you can dine you can dine at the piano bar you can dine at the um uh, pasta farai i think that's an italian based restaurant here also and you can also dine in the main dining area and if you want to go on the you know the beach side if it's not rainy then you can definitely do that as well also um there's a chinese section that you can dine also so guys it all depends on your taste and what exactly it is that you want to do and what it is that you want to accomplish they will help you to get there um also theme nights are not the only entertainment that they provide they provide other um and they provide other entertainments here also at Hedonism too. My favorite, which I went to last night and I got drunk, was at the disco. The disco is amazing. So if you come to Hedon, definitely go to the disco and enjoy the amazing music and enjoy their mixed drinks because they have drinks there as well. It's always a party night here at Hedon. You just let go, just be free, 
and just enjoy yourself. So like I stated, the food, 10 out of 10. Entertainment, 10 out of 10. Um, the rooms, always 10 out of 10 because it's always so freaking clean. And customer service, freaking amazing. When you come here, ask for Brit and Stacia. Trust me, Super Mario. I'm not forgetting about you either. So guys, please remember these people and get to them when you get to Hito because they will take good care of you. And also my friend Kirk from the boat rides. Also check him. He's fucking amazing. Um, yeah, so food, 10 out of 10. Activities, 10 out of 10. Customer service, 10 out of 10. Rooms, 10 out of 10. I think I'm forgetting something. The prices, I don't want to tell you the prices. They have a website. I'm not sure if they would want me to publicly say what their price ranges range from because I don't know. I just see it as a kind of disrespect. But they have their prices and if not, you can call in and ask them for local rates to find out how much it would cost to stay here per night depending on the room that you want. You know, if the jacuzzi room is a premium room, the premium room comes with the refrigerator stock to get your robe, you get your slippers, and all the good stuff. I am currently at an OVN room, which is an ocean view on natural. So on natural means it's still on the nude side, but it's just not a premium room with the jacuzzi. You understand? All right, I did get a bottle though. I did get a bottle I'm covering because that's my government name and I don't want it to be showing so I did get a bottle but no robe or whatever and that's totally fine with me I'm good because at the end of the day I get to enjoy all of this okay I get to enjoy everything there is to offer so I'm actually good like YouTube that's not my breast okay that's just my chest because I don't want y'all thinking that I'm showing something that I'm not supposed to be showing you can come here at least once in your life you should definitely take the chance to come here and enjoy yourselves because you will not guess i'm always not looking in the camera yeah so if you get the chance definitely come to hito at least once in your life and i'm sure once you come here you're not gonna want to stop coming here trust me take it from somebody who told herself she was not gonna come back here after the first visit this is the third one. The third one, okay? <laughs> no, because he is just a place where you just come, you just let go. Whatever troubles you have, you left it at the gate. You leave it at the gate of Hido and you don't bring it inside because this is a place to just relax, enjoy yourself, eat some good food, listen to some good music, dance with some random girl, dance with some random guy just because you can, okay? And enjoy some weed at Hido Weedo also. I mean, the forbidden fruits strength okay you need to you need to try that and the smoke room is there so you can definitely go there and just get high if you need to there's a tennis court that you can enjoy a very big tennis court that you can enjoy um and if you don't want to play tennis and you want to watch they have an area that you can sit and watch tennis being played so like guys this is a full package is it value for money yes it is i would definitely say it's value for money because they don't give cheap food okay they don't do that they give top notch top quality food they give top notch top quality entertainment they have a freaking gym that you can use you have a um sauna room that you can go in i did not go in the sauna room y'all i always say to that I've, whenever i come back to heat i'm going in there and i've never gone into the sauna room still you have everything on your fingertips at your fingertips and I just feel like you can't regret something like this. I just don't think so. If you're an open-minded individual who's just looking to have fun, looking to let loose, looking to just do whatever it takes, then hedonism too is a place for you. Period. Like, and hedonism too is also a part um, partnered with Royalton Grand Lido. Grand Lido is the nude side of Royalton to enjoy yourself. I'm guessing if you were at the nude side of Hido, they, they would send you at the nude side of Royalton. And probably if you are at the prude side of Hido, they would send you at a regular side at Royalton. I'm not sure, but this has been my experience. I can only speak from my experience. Okay, so yeah, that's it. That is it, y'all. That is it. Thank y'all so much for tuning in. I appreciate you guys so much. If there are any other questions, if I can answer, I will definitely answer your questions, guys. 
thank you all so much for tuning in i appreciate all my supporters trust me i support you i appreciate you guys so freaking much okay this is indeed your girl to my person signing out bye